Hey guys, want to root your Google Pixel but don't know where to begin? Don't worry. In this video, I'll show you step by step how to root any Pixel phone using Majisk. This method works on Android 14, 15 and even Android 16. Also, this method supports every model including the Pixel 6a, Pixel 7 Pro, Pixel 9 and even the latest Pixel 10. It's safe, simple and completely beginner friendly. So just follow along and you'll have root access in no time. But before we begin, make sure your bootloader is already unlocked. I've made a dedicated video on how to unlock the bootloader, so watch that first and then come back here. Alright, in this video, I'm using the Pixel 6 running on the latest Android 16. But don't worry, this method also works perfectly on Android 14 and Android 15 as well as on other Pixel models. The first step in rooting your Pixel phone is to enable developer options. To do this, open the settings app, then scroll down and tap on about phone. Here, find the option called build number and tap on it seven times until you see developer option is enabled. Once done, go back and open system and then developer options. As you can see, my bootloader is already unlocked. Make sure your Pixel's bootloader is unlocked too. Scroll further down and enable USB debugging. This lets your Pixel connect with your computer during the routing process. Once that's done, connect your Pixel to the PC with a data cable and let's move to the computer screen. Now it's time for step 2, getting boot image for our Pixel device. First, just open any browser and type in OTA Google Pixel along with your device model. Then just open the first link from Google's official site, it's called Full OTA Images. Here simply scroll through the list and find your Pixel model. For example, I'm going to search for the Pixel 6a. Alright, so here's the firmware, BPA32 from September 2025, the one I need for my Pixel 6a. Now the important thing here is to make sure the build number matches the one already running on your Pixel phone. Always double check this because if it doesn't match, your device could end up in a boot loop. Now I'll cancel the download here since I already have it saved on my PC. So now we've got three files ready, the OTA extractor, the platform tools and the firmware. The first thing we need to do is extract all of them. I'll quickly do that here. Once everything is extracted, you can delete the zip files, just to keep things clean and easy to follow. Now open the firmware folder. Inside you'll see a file called payload.bin. All we need to do is move this file into the OTA extractor folder. After that, just drag and drop the payload.bin file onto the OTA extractor exe. If you get a warning pop-up, click on more info and then run anyway. This will start extracting all the image files like the boot image, VB meta and a few others. Just give it a moment and let the process finish completely. And yes, the process is complete. All the files are here now. For rooting, we only need the boot.img file. But if you're planning to install a custom ROM or a custom kernel later, you'll also need the vbmeta.img file. One more thing to remember, if your firmware has an init underscore boot.img file, then you'll need to copy that instead of the regular boot.img. In my case, the firmware only has a single boot.img file, so I'll just copy that one. Once the files are moved, open the platform tools folder. Inside, you'll see adb and fastboot files. Now click on the address bar at the top, type command and press enter. This will open the command prompt right inside the platform tools folder. We'll be using this later. Alright, now take the boot.img file and copy it to your Pixel phone using a USB cable. Let me quickly move it. And yes, here's our boot image. Now it's time for step 3, patching the boot image using Majisk. First, install the Majisk app on your Pixel phone and open it. Here, tap on install, then choose select and patch a file. Now browse and select the boot.img file you just copied. 
Once selected, tap on Let's Go. Magisk will patch the file for us. Give it a few seconds to complete the patching process. And that's it. The patching is done. The patched file is now saved in your download folder. Let's quickly confirm it's there. And yes, here's our patched file. Now let's move it over to the PC so we can flash it. Alright, once the patched file is moved back to the PC, it's time for step 3, flash in the Magisk patched file. In the terminal, type the command ADB Reboot Bootloader. This will restart your phone into fast boot mode. Just wait for your device to boot up. Once your phone is in bootloader mode, type fast boot devices. This checks if your PC can see your phone in fast boot. If you see your device's serial number here, you're good to go. Now it's time to flash the patched boot image. If you have the patched boot.img, then run this command. Fast boot flash boot and path of magsec patched file. Just drag and drop the patched file to the terminal. But if you only have the patched initboot.img, then run this instead. Fast boot flash init underscore boot and path to magis patched file. Once you hit enter, you'll see OK pop up a couple of times. That means the file flashed successfully. Now it's time to reboot your phone. Just type fast boot reboot and hit enter. Your phone will restart and the first boot might take a little longer than usual. So be patient and just let the phone do its thing. Alright, the device has now booted up. Let's open the Magisk app and check if everything worked. We've got a pop-up saying additional setup required. It just needs to reboot the device. Simply tap OK and your phone will restart automatically. Just wait for it to finish. And yes, the device has rebooted. Now let's open the Magisk app again to confirm everything. And yes, as you can see, it says installed, which means our Pixel device is successfully rooted. Let's double check with the Root Checker app. So let me open the app. And there we go. Root Access is now successfully installed on your Pixel phone running Android 16. So that's for this video on how to root Pixel phone using Magisk running Android 16. If this step-by-step -step guide helped you, don't forget to hit that like button and consider subscribing to the channel. It really helps a lot. Also, I've added all the download links and commands in the description. So check them out if you need them. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.